Kiana Sage here and welcome to this month's Being In Sync Insights. So one of the things that comes up with clients repeatedly, almost every single client, is some of them have goals that are just beyond. And so a beyond goal would be that's out of your reach, that you haven't done the steps in order to get to that goal. So for example, I had a client that said, well, I want to be a billionaire. Uh, a millionaire wasn't enough. They weren't even making $50,000 at the time. So how are they going to be a billionaire? They didn't care, but they just wanted that. So that would be an example of something beyond your reach. Another one would be being at an entry level position, which often comes when I when I hire interns and they think that they could do what I've done or what I do and I've been doing it for 20 some odd years and they think that they should be the lead consultant or at least a consultant. And so that would be something that's out of the realm of possibilities for them within the next year or two. There's no reason um, to not have big goals, but the problem that comes with having these goals that are out of touch is that they actually create the opposite. They don't keep you hopeful, they actually create a lot of density and resistance within your energy body that's like, oh, I'm still not there. I'm still not the senior consultant, or I'm never gonna be the CEO, or um, I can't even remember the other example I gave because there's so many different ones that people come up with but, oh, they're billionaire. You're not gonna be a billionaire and be able to hold on to it. And there's a lot of research around even the lottery winners that can't even manage the money. And the reason why is this. It's a quantum leap. And a quantum leap means that it's an energetic shift that's so beyond what they're used to that they can't even manage it. So here's the tip for you for this being in sync insight is to make sure that your goals are incremental. And I know in a lot of organizations they have, you know, nine, five year goals, 10 year goals, 20 year goals, and, and that's fine if they want to do that. But what's really most important is where are you right now? And what are you creating that's going to get you a step in the right direction towards that next goal? Don't worry so much about having your five-year plan. Focus on what's in 30, 60, 90, what's happening in the year, and, and get really crystal clear on what's important right now, and make sure that's aligned, because whatever happens here now is what determines what's going to happen in your future. So that way, when you get to being a billionaire, you can actually manage the money. It won't be such a shock to your energy system and there won't be any resistance to being a billionaire because you would have already taken the steps that are required to be one. So, my suggestion is that keep it focused in the here and now and know that where you're at right now determines where you're going to go. So make sure that you're aligned for where you want to go in the near future, like in the present, what's happening and see how things go for you there. You should find that you feel lighter, more energized, more excited, and more anticipating all the awesomeness that's gonna come your way. So cheers to being in sync.